rattling noises on their vehicles, high repair bills, and fear of walking on a road littered with potholes are among concerns being raised by some residents of Prior Park Terrace, St. James. June Fowler, who has lived there for 38 years, says she had never seen the road repaved. My vehicle is in three years yet, and I don't care when to get in money to get service that even tell me some things because I hear noises. And, and that is a, a, a fear for me because I had a noises before. And the thing is that if you, if you try to avoid one, there's another. And however you try to maneuver around the, the potholes, you can't because it's difficult. So we just want either to have it patched, but patched properly so that many rainfall, the tar and the grit don't just disappear again and we have these holes. Or give us a paving. We've been living here for 38 years and we've never had a, a, a repaving of these roads. I drove through holders on Sunday and I was shocked to see the entire holder section is paved. Now that was like worse than here. But I was happy to see it paved, but I'm saying, so give us a chance. You tell you to your member parliament? Yeah, I sent an email. Um, I also called the Ministry of Transport and Works and they gave me the contact for the prospect. Um, depot because they say that would be the closest one to us. I called them and talked to somebody there. She said, well, you know, I didn't just hear all. I said, yeah, I understand that. But at least put us on the list. And she said, yeah, I tried calling back last week. Number was not, um, you know, you get that voicemail, not available or something. Try again in the afternoon, still can get through. So I thought, you know what, when I saw that article that you guys did in Station Hill, I thought, well, let me call the nation and see if we can maybe get some level of understanding out there in the, in, the, in the public that, you know, we ain't asking for much. Joan Clark and Eden Broom, who live next door to each other, also can't remember the last time the road was paved. They have resided in the neighborhood for more than 30 years. Broom said some bitumen was thrown in the holes, but it washed away with the rain, and many people who used to walk in the morning for exercise have stopped. Efforts to reach parliamentary representative Carrie Simmons were unsuccessful.